right, so we're going to be starting off this uh, Iron Man episode 4 series, I meant 5, golly, we're going on 5, uh, with a medium clue casket. I don't even know where to dig. Somewhere up in here. Okay, let's see what I got here. Oh, yeah. The fact that I thought I may get lucky and get rangers. Nah. Anyway. Hey, guys. Here, we're about to get 78 rune crafting. Yay! Just a little game there. And, uh, I think I'm going to move on to thieving. I'm not very sure what I'm going to do. Okay, guys, it looks like we just got um, 83 thieving, so if uh, that's great. And if you're interested on Pyramid Plunder, it's great XP per hour. I have a guide on my channel, and honestly, I want to go for 99 thieving. The problem is I've just been so busy with school, and since it's non afkable it's kind of hard. Guys, we're a few XP from 90 defense. And then, of course, I'll go on to leveling my attack. There it is, 90 defense. Awesome. Uh, I've got a Dark Beast Slayer task. So I've just been doing, getting away from the skilling for a little bit just to do some combat. Because if I can get my combat up to all 90s, hopefully I can start doing, like, major God Wars dungeon bosses. Here I got 84 farming. It seems like I've gained a farming level every single episode so far. I just wanted to take a video of this because uh, I got a superior dark beast on this task. Uh, these guys can really hurt. You gotta be kind of careful. I mean, check this out. I'm getting wrecked. If you don't move in a certain way to dodge it, you could be in trouble. There's three special attacks and you have to move, basically. But these things are hard to kill. It's no joke. Like, they have a ton of HP. So, this may just be a long clip. Close, guys. There we go. Um, and I got, wow, a dark, well, at least I got the totem, but, like, the square shield. Nah, bro, let me see my coins. Wow, nothing. Oh, well. What in the world, guys? I got another dark beast, like, superior. And the problem with this, oh, gosh. Is that I don't have any food so this is gonna be interesting guys get that next superior dark beast kill uh I almost died 6k slayer XP drop but that's insane we got a uh, snapdragon seed from that yeah I'm gonna have to bank I wasn't really expecting to get two superiors All right guys I just got done with a KVD trip I my private chat's never on friends, but since I go to the wild for KBD, I have two left on my task, but I did eight kills that inventory. I don't know if it was just luck, but I've been averaging six to eight kills, and dang, it's just, I've gotten either good at soloing KBD or the setup's right, I don't know. Okay, here I'm about to get 91 crafting. I, uh, it's a pretty big level. A lot of people ask me, especially Iron Men around the same level as I am, are like, how did you get your crafting level? And the truth is, I just do mostly my battle stabs every day, and I think that really adds up. And also I make those unpowered orbs. And I think that that is the majority reason of how or how I got my crafting level. Also, I got some more seaweed and sand buckets. I'm going to be making some more unpowered orbs soon. And then I was just doing little stuff like this um, to have more glories in my bank and such. But yeah, that's crazy. Um, I've been like working on everything, so I haven't actually gotten a level in a while, which is kind of exciting because I keep hopping from different stuff. And uh, the closest level I have next is range. Uh, hey guys, this is really interesting. I got a one thousand or one in one one in two thousand drop at Cow Fight Queen. A jar of sand, pretty rare. Um, not that great of an item, but uh, 
pretty lucky on that. Too bad it wasn't like the pet, but oh well. Oh, I don't know if y'all saw that, but I got 90 attack. Um, I don't think I got that in recording on time. Mm -mm. I'm sitting here eating some beans. Mm. So good. I got home at like 10 o'clock from university. But yeah, we go 90 attack, looking good. And, uh, well, we're about to finish this task. 27k from 91 Slayer. Check it out. We got 96 range. How about them apples? That's a great achievement. I'm here at Wyvern's, um, because I got a, uh, skeletal wyvern task, which worked out because I needed to get my, whoa, 1 mil XP to 97. Crazy. I need to get my range up anyway, so I was like, I'm going to range these guys. Okay, guys, I'm here about to get 80 prayer. Um, we're one step closer to getting all 80 stats. Uh, the only thing I'm kind of missing out on is I need two more rune crafting levels, but here it is, 80 uh, prayer. So that's awesome, and I can now wear the dragon bone necklace that is in my bank. I don't know if anyone knew this, but I got that dragon bone necklace from Vorkath. It's like a 1 in 1k drop, but at least now I can finally wear it. I don't know if I'll ever use it, but it's nice bank value. Okay, guys, we're about to get 91 Slayer. Huzzah! And now I can pretty much unlock um, my Hellhounds. I had those um, blocked, but now I can do Cerberus, and I don't have to worry about boosting and all that. So that's good. And, um, by the way, these neck reels, I bursted them in the catacombs for 99 uh, along with Dust Devils, but now that I'm 99 Mage and training melee, I was like, let me try these out in the Slayer Tower. And they drop a ton of seeds and limp roots, which is good for Herbler, uh, also soft clay. And so these are pretty good too, and I recommend it. Okay, guys, that is going to end it for Iron Woman Series Episode 5. I'm sorry it's taken me so long to get it out there. I've been super busy with university. And I always leave my private chat on in-game. However, if I'm slow to respond to you, and maybe because I got mixed in with other messages and all those things like that. But I try to respond to everyone who messages me. Thank you so much for watching and like this video if you enjoyed it and you feel welcome to subscribe to my channel for more Iron Woman videos and just a bunch of in real life videos I do and some RuneScape guides and things like that. Thank you so much for watching.